Nah, it's with a good bowling force as you do, and that is such a good shot out of nowhere. But you've still got to execute. Look at that, it's just, all, it's just a scoop. And it's a lovely shot. And it's six. Another hundred bucks from KFC. Beast fine leg who's up in the circle. And once it beats that player there, it's very, very short down in that area and easy four. Nearly six and a half and over, which is not where they'd want to finish up, but it's on the, it's in the right direction. Smeared away in the offside. Not brilliant timing, but that'll be four as well. It's a little counter punch here. It's a nice shot again. A look at that. No real risk, to be fair. Throwing his hand so hard at it, it's going to fly. Good placement. Boy, that's good placement. Great use of the bottom hand. And uh, picks up four to finish the over. 44 for two. Good placement again. Lovely stuff. Just helping into that gap behind square. It's a beautiful shot again. If there is a big part of it, it's right in these funny little pockets in the corners here. And the second boundary, at least, they just hit over, over in that area. Really making the most of the bounce. Just waits for it, gets inside the line. Slow ball, it's going to work. Brilliant stuff. No, it could fall in the middle. Indecision, indecision in the end. Has he got it? Yes, he's got it. <laughs> well, he thought it was the keeper's catch, but in the end, Solly had to put the afterburners on and do the work himself. It was out there. It was taking all the pressure off him. Slow ball, didn't pitch, but that's what did the trick. And you always feel those top ones. You leave them to the man with the gloves on, and he has only just got that. And the most relieved player out there, Fletcher. Well played over the top. He needs to do something here, Foxcott, and to, as we head towards the middle of this innings. He needs boundaries, and that was clever play. Foxcroft and why he was one of the top run scorers in the Super Smash campaign last year. He's going to pick up a wicket here. That is an absolute yeah. gift to mid on. And rightly furious with himself is Ollie White. He's just chipped it down mid on's throat. And how's that for a debut start? Foxcroft got them back in a little bit. Ollie White probably just, just got the measure of the pitch, but then this happens. He just spoons it out. New bowler. Oh, he nearly had another. Nearly had another. It's all smiles, but it's a wry smile. It's a bit of a lucky escape there. Good length, good edge, genuine edge. Cam Fletcher is pretty acrobatic. He couldn't reach it. Everybody watching the cricket. And another wicket. Just as we say, Lou Johnson spoons one. Another one for Jock McKenzie. He's loving this cricket. And picks up his second wicket. Johnson just tried to give himself a bit of room, shifting to the leg side to open up. Covers and long off, I'm sure, but all he could. Keeps back in the crease, hits straight this time. And that's a good shot. Good shot from Dean Foxcroft. It's a lovely shot. Let's take a look here. Oh, you might not see it, but just the step back. Just manages to clear that space for himself so he can hit it. Here it is here. Just that right foot goes back. He knows he wants to hit it straighter as in right back over the bowler's head, Nick. That's well, a big swing. Could be a chance. We're probably not going to quite get there. No, it's for Dale Phillips standing up this ante. Wide long on cow corner area. Phillips saying, I'm not going to keep hitting this to cover or mid-off. I'm going to go leg side. Well, backs away. There's a go. Just gets a nick. And that's the end of him. Good positivity, good intent, but unfortunately the execution let him down, and that was a big healthy nick through to Cam Fletcher. Doing very well. That is again a slower ball, I think off cutter, but again that just a hard length. And I wouldn't be surprised if Foxcroft and Phillips had decided that. Oh, it's hit hard, hit straight, might be the fielder. No, what a. Oh, yes, it does, unfortunately. It was a good start. Robbie O'Donnell thought he had it, but just let it slip at the last minute come out not quite sure but it must be a little bit unnerving when you're going to dive down there and you're going from grass or even running over that you can see that and at the end of the day well he did have it didn't he
It's almost like a catch which pops out when your arms hit the ground. So this is in the air and beats the fielder. And a bit of power and a bit of distance. And the drought between sixes is broken by Lockrose. Lockrose with a strike rate coming into this. Provided him with some width to be fair, McKenzie, but 166 if I remember right. Oh, that's a long hit. It's high. And into the stands. Lovely shot. Ben Lockrose. It's his second six for the innings. Player, Ben Lockrose, who can take the score from pretty average below par to something which gives the Vaults an opportunity, a chance in this match. Well, that's squeezed out, squirted out. And that'll be another boundary as well for this time. And Lockrose starting to pile up the runs. Yeah, he's obviously gone a bit wider. He's got the length spot on. That's a beautiful Yorker. Delfort gave it his best. Through him. Bowled him. He's gone now. Lockrose. His energetic, positive intent filled innings is over. And Dunry Ferns gets the last laugh after getting hit for 10 off two balls. And that one there is spot on again, that Yorker link. Look at that. Oh, full again. And that's driven nicely. Should be cut off. No, it kept running away. That's a fantastic first ball by Hazeldean. To play that first ball, look at this. It's just about there in that Yorker length again, but to go first ball through extra cover with enough power to beat. Oh, innovates this time, but Vern's too good. Balls the Yorker ball again and says no, no. First ball, which was a beautiful shot. Now, it was almost there, to be fair. It was almost there, and with fine leg up and a short boundary behind him. And Ben Lister comes in. Hoisted away. Just the one. Oh, swing and a miss. And a bye, perhaps, could be on at the bowler's end. Oh, might have a look at that. It's a direct hit. Looks like the umpire's going to go upstairs. And Foxcroft, understandably, needs to get to the other end and face what's left of this over as much of it as he can. It's a little bit of a sacrificial run there. Ball's coming in now. Better short of the line. Ball gets broken. I'm ready to make my decision for the big screen. Dug out by Foxcroft. He's pushing for two. Yes, he wants it. Oh, could be confusion. This could be the end of the inning. In the end, all it's done is get up in the 10th wicket falling for the vaults. You can see they're both pushing hard. Duffy going. Well, to be fair, Foxcroft was going as well, realising there was no run. Put the brakes on and called no, but by that's... Lovely shot, top of the bounce. And away for four. Just hung out a little bit too wide by Muller. Not really wide, but you can see there, just wait into the ball by George Worker. And by six point and cover. And it is a fast outfield. He's in trouble here. <laughs> he's in big trouble because he's gone at third man. <laughs> Just as we're talking about immensely. Apologies, George. Got a very wide delivery. To be fair to the vaults, that's well done. Setting that square. Th There's execution there of the highest calibre. What a great delivery, but still, you have to play this. And that is your first ball. That is an absolutely gorgeous cut shot. Over the top. Yeah, top edge. Thought for a minute maybe first slip had a chance, but keeper and first slip just watched it go over. Watched the first slip, not a top edge pull over top of slip. Yeah. Going to get another. Just cloth. Yes, yeah. yes. Not hit at all. A little bit extra pace coming on and no one. Early on in this game is getting a feel for the surface at all. It was getting through. Good pace, good hustle. Just coming on to Solia quicker than he thought. Looking for that pull shot, which he tried a couple of... Nice shot. Too full, little full. He gave the opportunity for Donald to get off the mark by finding the middle of the bat. 
a lot of cricket, scored a lot of runs. Even though Hazel Dean's bowling well, if you just over pitch slightly, a player of O'Donnell's caliber. Ripper. That is class. That has class written all over it. Robbie O'Donnell finishing the over off 4-6. 25 for 2 from 4. This is out. This is out. It's another one. It's another mistimed shot and another easy catch to a player standing there on the 30-yard circle. And all he can do is just spoon it up to mid on. Again, Duffy just hitting the pitch hard, getting good bounce. O'Donnell looking to get on with. Oh, it's four. Uh, it, it went fine. <laughs> I thought it just looked like it was going to be regulation pickup. It went very fine, and, and those. Do creep up. In fact, they're probably right next to you by the time that ball rolls away. It's, it's a short boundary, but it's well played. Calls of catch it, but it was always a bit wide and a brilliant, desperate effort down at fine leg, but it was always too fine. Handy runs for the aces if they're going to chase this total down. They really need to stay close to that run rate, and that will help immensely given the three dots proceeded. Smeared away on the offside for six, it's gone the whole way. This is a slice tracer bullet. Cam Fletcher, good confidence, good bravery. At the end of the day, just a very... Oh, it's in the gap. There was some interest for him in the middle, but it was always clearly in the gap, and a couple of bounces away for four. But actually, this was a well-judged and executed shot. Stepped inside the line. That front foot pull, so important. Popular shot for keepers. Good. How was this hit? Not well at all. Don't swear. Doug, oh, you can, you, can, you can breathe again. You've had an amazing stroke of luck there, my friend. Thanks for joining us. Absolute pleasure, guys. Control going straight down his throat, but unfortunately, just missed out. One, two, this could go for four. It's gone right in the gap. Teased them the whole way. Just a little bit extra pace. That's what Hazel Dean is providing. And on that occasion, it helped the batter. But the ball goes along it. This was no exception. Right into another deep pocket. Split the fielders perfectly. And I thought either of them would pick it up. And they just kept running away from them. Catch it. Get around there. No, it's in the gap. And it's all the way for six as well. That wouldn't have been caught even if someone was standing on the rope of energy you can see he wants this wicket so intense just not going his way and that is the 235th oh that flew away off the outside edge they were shouting to catch it at third man like almost like a slip catch you can understand jacob duffy want to throw it up maybe get a little bit of a nick or catch in the covers this one big edge Fletcher in particular well, that is massive, and that is a good example of Fletcher's strengths and his hand-eye coordination. That is absolutely flying up into the top of the west stand here at Eden Park. And that is his 50. Oh, he's moosed that. That's gone high and long and wide. And the gap between the north and the west stand this time. St. John's Ambulance. They're okay. That's a slow ball. That's a, that's a big off-cutter, slower ball. And it's just held probably a bit short in hindsight but again Fletcher is in good form and seeing it well here we go off the roof but a pinball well helps himself over the offside this time Cam Fletcher no need to run for that but watch out if you're the ball kid yeah be careful or so whatever grade you're playing young man be careful yeah but that's a beautiful shot that's over wide that off look at this skips away oh is searching for that wicket. Well, he might have it. Is this a chance? No, good effort. Just yorked himself, just trying to get in the position. He had to try and go for the catch. Has to try and make a difference, but couldn't quite reel it in there. And Gibson unlucky, but aces get closer. And that will be it. That is through. And that is a couple of runs. And what is a very comprehensive win for the Auckland Aces.